What's up, ladies and gentlemen, Captain Biscuit here, and welcome back to another Reapers of the Abyss, as shown by that signal over there. Welcome to the very first large ship of the Reapers, the Oppressor Capital, well, the Oppressor Frigate. It's not a capital ship, it's a frigate, because it's not that big. So, this is the second ship to come out the, well, the second, well, second type of ship to come out the void. Following off from the Tyrant and the Warlord, this came flying through to destroy worlds, pillage, reap, and enslave, all ready for the factions update, which came out yesterday. Brilliant. So, as I always do, I'll have a fly around, show her all off in all her glory, and then we'll get inside, have a fly, and hopefully get the guns working, because weirdly they weren't working earlier, so it might be just a uh, patch glitch, but we'll find out. So, let's start with the front. We'll start with the front, we'll make our... Actually, no, if we start here... And we'll make our way around. So, nice, nice design to a nice big bulkhead. I wanted a bulkhead for once. This is the very first ship where I've built it from. Normally, I do a, a oh, yeah, don't I? Normally, I do a guideline like this, so it's a, so it's a flat. But instead, I did it overall this time and built through the overall. I think it looks much better. So I'm probably going to start doing my designs for my ships, making the outline for the oval first and bringing it backwards, not doing the whole. Uh, perimeter outlined and building up. So I think it just gives us a, a deeper, a different, a deeper, a different look to it, which is always nice. So, first of all, like I said, the Reapers of the Abyss symbol will now be cropping up on most ships. So there we go, looking in all its glory. Lovely red lights to go with the the dark grey and the red theme. Frontal frontal capacity, looking pretty sweet. Each one of these has got rocket pods there. Nice little bit of light. Also, lovely forward thrusters. This does stop in a second, which is beautiful. Not normally, my ships don't normally do that. Normally, it takes them about half an hour to stop. Right. That's just the other side. Loads of bottom thrusters. We'll go to the back. As you can see, there's where the flight deck will be, is when we go inside. Actually, this one's actually kitted out inside as well, which is nice. And that's the back. That's what you're looking at. Lots of power, which is nice. I don't. I'm gonna have to ask some people. I'm gonna have to ask some people. I have to get some people to show me how to pr make proper back engines because these look all right, but they're quite boxy. So I might. Mm. When I make the next one, I will. I will try to do something a little bit different. Maybe taking these chunked design. Well, these kind of like ribbed designs to put them there. We'll see what we can do. I like this idea. It's having these corner pieces here and then having three, so it's flattened. There's like these um plated pieces which look quite cool. So, we'll just go inside, have a look inside, fly her off, and then finish, well, finish up. We drop down here. First thing you're greeted by is, because this, because I built this a bit weirdly, to get up to the flight deck, it's up that way, so I've had to have some guns here just to protect it, but that's the engine room as well. <laughs> so it's all kind of a little bit confined at the moment. Pop, drop, pop and drop, two. Oh, we're good. Are we good? Yeah, we're good. Two large reactors. Uh, pumping this station. It only needs one to run, so if one gets taken out, the other ones will suffice. Loads of gyroscopes to keep her moving. Red lights again. We'll come out this way. Oh, now I like this idea. We just quickly fly. So I've got this hallway, and in each hallway I've got just some seats, so your pirates will sit here, and then when, you know, when the oppressor has done its damage and it's, it's worked its magic, these guys come out and they roll in. And they seize ships, overhaul them, kill all the, kill all the, um, all the crewmen, and take over the ship, and then scrap it down, and sell it on the black market, or just use it for another ships. So not much on this side here. Behind this big wall is all the guns, um, and it's just got a few cargo containers for a bit, of, for a bit of um, cargo storage. So we go back this way. Woo, wish em. Hey, yep, and we'll go up. Right. Best way of doing this. Walk forward. Look back. And, uh, oh, by the way, this ship will be going onto the Steam Workshop. That's why I put that up there. And drop down. So then we've got this little, little hallway. And then same again. Spin around so you're looking the other way. Jetpack on and fly up. And then we're up to this. Ve oh, and we fall back down because we're stupid. And we come to this very, very small ship. Uh, deck, flight deck, which is good in a way because it'll be harder to hit, but you know, I can't run out of room. 
So we have a quick 360 view of the flight deck. And there we go, looking all sweet. So we click this just to have a look at it. 3.5 million kilograms, looking sweet. Power usage, we're looking at a 1.14%, so she's using barely anything. And when I kick on the forward thrusters, we go to a quarter, so you can really survive on one reactor, which is nice. Uh, 85 thrusters, mainly all pointing towards the back, though we do have quite a bit on the front. And 31 gyroscopes to be able to actually turn this beast. So we're going to kick her forward, and I'm going to show you how quickly she stops. So we're going to get up to about 7, let's get 10. And there you go, she stops quick, which is nice. Always nice to see. Also, next thing, also this antenna is now, because of the Factions DLC, the Factions DLC, the Factions uh, update, this antenna is now blocked for me, because I have to now put in Factions. But, let's give her weapons a try, shall we? Oh, I don't, no, okay, let's just, oh, okay, let's try. Go around this way. Oh, 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 oh. There we go, that's what we wanted to do. Nope, the guns aren't firing. So maybe if I... If I just quickly go K. And if I go... Mm, access denied. No share. Share with my factions. Share with all. Okay, maybe that. Maybe if I go down here, the guns are... Ah, there we go, that's why. So we go. Two, three, four, five, six. Share with all. Means I should be able to fire them. One. No, still not being able to fire. Access denied, no share. Maybe I need to make an owner. Right, let's make an owner. Create owners. Tag. R. O. A. Reapers of Abyss. Name Reapers of the Abyss. Uh, public info. Okay. Oh, okay. Now this makes founder and then control panel. Maybe this has sorted this out. Owner. Why can't I change the owner of this? Oh, this is confusing. Factions, Reapers of the Abyss. I, 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 I don't know. Basically, when when I can work it out, it will fire guns. It will fire these. There's seven missile t missile launchers on the front, so it does a hell of a lot of damage on the front. So that's been a quick look at the oppressor oppressor attack frigate thing. I'm a do hickey my bob. Sorry, because this factions pack has confused me. It's kind of put me off a bit. Sorry about that. But there you go, that's the Oppressor War Frigate. I've been Captain Biscuit. Hope you guys have liked this. Turn this on and spin around. I've been Captain Biscuit. Hope you guys have liked this. Please like and subscribe if you feel like it. Don't worry if you don't. And I will see you guys next time. Peace, guys. Woo!